the one other thing I was going to say was that um, if you do Sportsman's Outdoor, whatever they say in the description is probably what's going to ship. So in my case, I assumed that when they said it was going to be the firearm and two magazines, that it would, you know, maybe include a SIG box or like, you know, things like that. No, it literally was the firearm and two mags. I've only got one here because other I've got loaded. Um, anyway, so whenever I went to the FFL to pick it up, he told me, oh, by the way, before you take it, I just want to let you know that they shipped it in paper and the box. And I was like, what? And he said, no, the paper and the box. And he handed me the box and said, here, like this. I pulled it open and sure enough, it was wrapped up in this like wrapping paper stuff. and inside just the FedEx box and I was like okay well that's kind of interesting didn't feel shady at all right <laughs> anyway that's uh I guess that's <clears throat> to be expected technically they just said that it was going to be in the firearm and two magazines so I guess lesson learned if you want to find out just check first and maybe call them because I had emailed them a question about this last week and Nobody ever got back to me on their side, so they may have just been pretty busy on with everything. And then they said some disclaimer on their thing saying it may take longer than, than normal to ship things. Um, <clears throat> they do have a good deal on ammo going right now, though. Um, I'm still waiting for that to come in. It's the Winchester T-Series Law Enforcement Surplus Ammunition. Um, that is going for like 50 rounds for like $20, which the steel it's like half price so and you can't even get it like on the straight up civilian market they don't sell it to civilians like like straight off the bat the only way you civilians get it is by uh, doing it like simply surplus like this so anyway that's just a follow-up video here uh, I'll probably do like a disassembly one later on tomorrow or something but I already I think in the previous video I said that I disassembled it and it was just completely filthy. So uh, just be prepared that if you pick up any kind of police trade in, they probably did not clean it before sending it to you. So I would not would not recommend taking it immediately to the range as soon as you pick it up. So anyway, that is that. So have a good one.